Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Question. Is your cat a single cat? Or specifically a single kitten? If the answer is yes, this topic could be just for you. And while today's presentation has nothing to do with the dating scene, the goings on could be just as frustrating. Does your pet seem a bit out of control at times? Constantly looking for ways to be entertained? A bit aggressive for what appears to be no reason at all? Anxious, on edge, just stressed out? If so, your cat could be suffering from what is known as single cat syndrome. This is a condition that is more or less hallmarked by anxiety, frustration, aggression, and just an overall sour mood and demeanor that can get worse with time. This is due to the lack of a positive outlet, someone to play with, someone to live with, someone around to prevent boredom, another cat, another animal, just something to relate to and enjoy. When it comes to remedies, there are truly only two options of value. Introduce another cat into the home or befriend someone in your neighborhood with an animal so that your cat and your neighbor's pet can have supervised play sessions a few times a week. Now, while Simply bringing another animal into the fold isn't always easy for several reasons. The only true way to eliminate single cat syndrome is to provide your cat with an outlet, a companion, and hopefully a friend. Sometimes cats, especially young cats, need more than just us to fulfill their essential needs. And because single cat syndrome is most often seen in kittens, it is always recommended whenever possible, to take at least two kittens during the adoption process, if for no other reason than to avoid what I've mentioned here today. And there you have it, rather short and sweet for this presentation. To the valued audience of Senior Cat Wellness, do you have any personal stories to share concerning this topic? Have you owned a single kitten and then found yourself highly compelled to get another cat? simply because your kitten was depressed, anxious, and perhaps misbehaving? If your pet's single cat syndrome prompted you to introduce another cat or even a dog into your home, please let me know. The comment section, as always, it's all yours. And until next time, I do thank you so very much for taking some time out of your very busy day to join me right here at Senior Cat Wellness. Did you like what you heard today? If you did, please feel free to like and share this video and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, we will talk to you later.